Okay, Draft Rig, welcome back to the third out of potentially five to six matches for the NLTS from my perspective. Um, for round three, we'll face Rainstar, who actually has a super similar team to Fetzer. Oh, interesting, this is almost the same. Hmm. I think. I think Landos is really good here. I wonder what a sheaf it is. It's probably it's probably water. Since it is water, I would say I can. Hmm. I think I can start with the casual flooded she lead. I think I bring these two in the back. I haven't been able to bring um, the giraffe a lot. <coughs> I think here it would be fine. I think that is like a game 2 tech. It's just a bit tough against the Urza Luna. Hmm. But it can snarl away. I think I'll, I think I'll try this and maybe bring giraffe for game 2 and 3. Let's see what Rainstar brings. Hey, he leads with Lillaboom for Igorov. Hey, the thing about that lead is that he probably tries to um, press fake out here. And I think I can easily go for a Terra Ghost Heat Wave and Dazzling Clean the Igorov. No, more Boss Igorov. <coughs> I think that should kill. Or do I go for Dark Pulse? No, I, th I think he would be safer. Surely. This is some super quick gameplay. I th don't think Green Star is even thinking at all. He's just pressing buttons. Oh, I love that. Let's see. Fake out did nothing. Moonblast. Oh, that did a ton. Oh, will Heatwave just clear from here? Oh, that is tough. That is tough. Yeah, without Trick Room, this is. Oh, this is a bad matchup without Trick Room for him. Luna first with Krum, yeah. And their Shifu. Is it water Shifu? It's not. Dark Shifu. Yeah, so Dark Shifu can suck a punch. Which makes me think I should go. For the lander switch. Dazzling Gleam will do a lot to both of these. Like also the Dazzling. I don't need Landris necessarily. If it just dies to like a Hyperwise, it's fine. Okay, go for the Terra Fairy, interesting. Did not go for the sucker punch. That was wicked blow. Wicked blow, blood moon. Yeah, unfortunately for him, the flutterman will just work it. Yeah, what I can do now is just um, moon blast the blood moon and sludge bomb the Ashiko. 
And I think nobody, no matter what he does, he loses one of these months. Sucker punches, but a sheep will shot drop here. Yeah. And even though Landros is surely also dead, the Yoga Punchy you can easily kill off the Ozaluna. We got overheat here. Clears us a little all the time. Oh, that's what that does, Luna. And that's a GG game one. Yeah, that looked very dominant. I'm not sure what his counterplay for that is. He can bring the Incineroar next time, I think that is a good call. But I think now I will lead um, Giraffe and Landris instead. That is what I'm thinking. Because I think he will try to bring the Incineroar. He will probably try to lead in Sinral um for off and keep Shifu and drop him as a loon at the back. I don't think the Ogre Palm has a lot to do with this match. Mm, do I lead the giraffe as well? It should be pretty good against Yeah. I I do have small now is like pretty good against Blood Moon as Luna. And it should wall a lot of his stuff. Yeah, I think it's these two and Chi Yu all the wellspring. Why is it all the wellspring? It's probably like Chi Yu Flutter main. I mean, Ogre Wellspring is still pretty good. I think this should be fine. And if it's not fine, I can just bring the same stuff as I get to game one. But I can always, like, turn one, go for Substitute, Substitute Snarl. And then start stalling out the Trick Room. Don't give him any free switches. Similar Ogre Palm. That is interesting. Okay, Intimidate doesn't do anything here. I think I protect the electrical web here. Or is it Dragon Pulse? Dragon Pulse will also do a lot. I mean, a lot. I think this is full special attack mother Raging Bolt. Yeah, he has to take out the Landorus. Okay, maybe since I should will be slower otherwise, I should probably electro up the Ogopon. And hope he gets a fake cut into that slot. Ah, uh, does he get up a sword since now? Oh no. <coughs> Did it all wrong already? I think now we cheat you and see what happens. Because I do need the landers here. Cheat you maybe can tank this and then hit back stronger. 
Oh, it's it's definitely Reluctant Heroes. Oh, yeah. For the grass attack. Lost three Ogre Farm. I think that should kill both Navi Cut from uh, here. I think Raging Raging Bolt could survive. But Chi you will. Oh. Survive a glide. That's important. That Electro did a lot to overcome. I think I will go flood on main Thunder Club. From honest that he can just glide. Does he glide though? Even if he does, I just go for Dragon Balls anyways. Yeah, I just sack Geo here, that's fine. That is fine. Because I will terrorize the sludge bomb from the clip here. I'm pretty sure I survive the uh, grass glide. And maybe Thunder Clap kills? Oh, I probably doesn't. But he might protect oh, all of them here. That did so much. Yeah, you can get the incinerator back in. Oh, he does. Try to snarl here. I think I have to hope that. Oh. I have to hope here that. Flood main can handle the Ogre Bomb. Yeah, that's the only way to just kill the Raging Bolt and I lose. It is what it is. Yeah, we don't survive. Yeah, that is fine. That's what we expected. Just try to Shadow Ball here into the Ogapon. Maybe he doesn't press Crazy Life for some reason. Yes. Unfortunately, he had to show the shadow ball here. It doesn't even kill. That's atrocious. Yeah, if I leave Chibi Flood on main of the Yoga Bone, what can he realistically do? 
He let all the opponents in row. All the opponents in row. Into that, the tornadoes would have been pretty great. Try to bring Chi Flutter again, same thing. I don't think that Raging Bolt has a place here, and so does Ogopon. Landris is pretty good, but it just gets outsped and faked out and stuff. Yeah, I think I have to do try it like this. Trying really hard not to throw away the game here. But I could very well be. The double grassy glide is very bad for my team. Because I do rely on on my electro web and tailwind and stuff. And you can just outspeed me every time. You have no uh, priority protection or immunities here. Shifu. That's another completely different lead. I, I think it's a DS probably um, fake out like a punch for the GU. And I think I have to switch immediately for that. I think I can switch at um, Dazzling Gleam and see what happens. Detect. That is a lot of damage. I think I elect web here and go into Chiyu. How much damage will Wicked Blow realistically do? Oh, surely not enough. I think GU Elect Web should be good. Because after that I can start out speeding the Ashima Kiko. If he presses like um, Wicked Blow here, I think. I think Wicked Blow might still kill here. Okay. Can I go for Dragon Pulse Heat Wave? I should survive a Circuit Punch Grassy Blast. At least I hope I do. That's crazy. How did he even know that kills? But it's a pretty smart move, I gotta say. I didn't think about that. No, we miss. No! Oh, come on. That's a crucial miss. I needed that. Aww. Yeah, I go flood him in here. He goes as a lunar. I think I have to go protect Heat Wave. Oh, 
does he does he try to glide into yeah okay we just need to hit here okay good fish good fish Perspective locked here is super weird. Why am I looking at it this way? Has he tarot yet? I don't think so. I did just protect you, Flutter Min, right? Oh, this is tough. I think I have to do it this way. Just hope um, Earth Power doesn't kill. Anything about that? Oh, the Oslona lives. That could have been a kill. Okay, now it's dead. Do we think a plus one um, horn leech kills? Oh, he doesn't have horn leech, he only has grassy glide. Yeah, so I think we just win. Grassy glide, sword stand, spike shield, ivy catch one. Oh, I'm a fast anyways. Not this. That's just GG then. That was a pretty good match. Very intense. Whew. Had to fight. Fight like a tough uphill fight here. Yeah, Chiyu Flutterman is truly a sight to behold. I like that. Okay, I think after three rounds we are... 2 and 1 now, only lost to Garbo, seems to be sweeping the old tourney anyway. And that was a lot of fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and we will see each other for part 4. Bye!